Well, good morning, everybody. I'm Mindy. I'm Jen. And I'm so excited to have Jen with us. If you don't know who Jen is, Jen works with me and Allie and WL Kids and helps do lots of things there. So today we're going to continue our conversation that we've started with Nick about four areas of family discipleship. So one is that intentional time. We gave a bunch of resources last week for that. Then there's seizing those moments that just pop up each day. Then there's like those developmental or milestones, those things that only happen one time in their life that are kind of special to capture, mm -hmm. and then holidays. Mm -hmm. So today we're gonna to talk about capturing some of those moments um, that just kind of pop up. So Jen and I are gonna share some ideas. What's one you have? Um, I used to like to take a moment in the kitchen when I was cooking with the kids, making a cake for somebody or even just cooking dinner and just talking through how their day was and what um, they're struggling with, um, what their friends might be struggling with and how we could pray for them. Um, and it was just a really enriching time for me to kind of have a peek into their lives. Yeah. And uh, like side by side, right? Mm -hmm. It's, it's yeah. way easier to talk side by side and yep. share versus like you're sitting down and drilling them yep. about what's going on. Yep. So, so Jen's staying in the kitchen. Um, we always pray for our kids on the way to school um, and I'm in the car. So that's another chance too. or when they get in the car after school and like, mm -hmm. Hey, how did it go today? Mm -hmm. And yeah. well, you know, verbal diarrhea everywhere. So you can kind of mm -hmm. pray through it, talk through it. Yep. Um, that's one other thing. And in the car, when you're driving, sometimes when we see an ambulance, we'll pray for the people in the ambulance. We don't know what's going on and we don't have to, but we can teach our yeah. kids, like you can pray for people you don't know. Yep, yep. Another thing that I like to do is I have an athlete in my family. So when our siblings, their siblings are in the stands with me, we would take a few moments to pray over the athletes and the coaches just to keep them safe. And um, for whoever who may not be saved even, like to have a moment where someone had spoken to them, um, they would hear them very, very well. So that's another great moment I think that we've used in our house. Yeah, lots of you have athletes, so mm, yeah. <laughs> good idea for that. Uh, so my dad loved the stars. He still does. Um, and, and so sometimes at night he would talk about that, or he, if it was dark, he'd say, hey, let's go outside and look at the different constellations. So he just would kind of seize those moments to point to God as creator and, and the beauty of nature. Mm -hmm. He also, I mean, we grew up on a farm, so we were outside a lot. So just capturing those moments when you're mm -hmm. outside, when you're on a walk, when the seasons are changing, just call it what it is. Say, hey, God did this yep. and, and tell your kids that over and over so they hear those moments of yep. praising him as creator. Mm -hmm. I know I have older kids now, so we, we hear things on the TV and the radio and sometimes they have questions and sometimes I don't have the answer, but we pray through that, like help us find the answer and help us to really have good conversations about that. And I think that's another, with older kids, I think that's a great way to kind of to see Jesus and to preach Jesus to them without preaching Jesus to them. <laughs> right. And what a good chance like to admit, like, I don't know. So let's mm -hmm. get our Bibles. Let's look. Let's yep. find the answer yep. because there's all sorts of places yep. um, God's given us his word so that we can do that. So those are just a few ideas mm -hmm. that we had for you this morning on capturing those moments. If you have other ideas, because we know lots of you have had lots of experience raising kids and grandkids, put those in the comments so that we can all be encouraged yeah. by the ways we can capture those moments with our kids as we disciple them. Sure. Yeah. All right. We'll see you next week. Bye.